absolute giant of the sport. Strong. Wow. He's looking strong. Suit's a bit too tight with that weight. I mean, it's sort of at the point now, you've got nothing else to lose on that. Man, they've gone 430 again. Yeah, kind of all off. I mean, a competition here is a great opportunity for him. He hasn't got a huge time zone different from Russia. So he's not having to worry about date lines and time zones. looking strong awesome and Blaine Sutherland knows his looks Go. now and of course Andre Kanavalov from Russia 492 and a half him and Sumner are just going to go head to head it's going to be toe to toe to to all the way isn't it whatever you can do I can do better yeah. this is huge You wouldn't right. know that they'd put 492 on there. Unbelievable. On any given day, 360 on a bench would be at the top of the pack. And today, 425 and a half. I keep looking at Blaine Sabner's nominated lift there. It's absolutely normal. It's not, and it's not even his biggest lift. Andre can do is keep getting his in, so I guess that's what they'll be thinking. That's about. his job. He's just got to come in, do his job, and wait for an opportunity. It's a nice touch. It's a quick, quick press call, and that looked like a pretty good bench. He's got a personal best total of 1,230. <laughs> And he's almost got a subtotal. He's almost got a predicted total of that already. Yep. Well, this really, really bridges some of that gap, doesn't it? If he can get this one in. Yeah, I mean that's the thing. He's got the opportunity. I guess Blaine has to take his first again. He doesn't have the opportunity to add anything to it, to his total. Whereas Kanavalov now has the opportunity to add 20 here. You know, and if this one goes well, maybe even another 10. Gets the touch. Oh, he's strong, isn't he? But just can't quite get that right hand side moving. Total. Yeah, he's going to make the deadlift. So and Sumner battles. can't add anything to his total from here. All of a sudden, he just closes that gap a little bit. And plenty of support in the crowd. He's got plenty of experience in that coaching corner too. He's got a team full of coaches, some of which are world champions themselves. Dragging it down. Yeah, I think he's lost his tightness there. Wow. Any other lifter, I would have said he's lost his tightness and hasn't got a chance. Big man, Andrei Karnavalov from Russia. 355. So he needs to make this look as easy as Blaine made 330 look really, yeah, doesn't he? He wants to be putting the pressure on. And he needs to make it look easy so the American coaches aren't looking, thinking, ah, oh, he's got not much left in the yeah. tank. Because when you're up against these guys, you're watching, you're trying to judge how much more room they've got left to move. Well, 
He certainly didn't make it look. It's not a bad idea to do that. I mean, it saves the athlete doing it when he get out on the platform and wasting any time. Uh, some talk of the, the platform being a little bit wobbly further forward, especially if you're a sumo. And you can move the bar anywhere you, you want. Put it where you want. 380. He was convincing at 355. Was he 380 convincing though? Quite there. Not today. Was okay. moving all right. What has Carnivalov got left up his sleeve? And there's not a whole lot you can do playing with the suit and the deadlift. And just a little bit too heavy today. 